Hey, welcome back to my channel. I am Adriana and today I have a Corona stockpile haul for you guys. So like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the gray notification bell to be notified anytime I upload. And also y'all share my videos. Share it with your cousin, your grandma, your auntie, your baby daddy, your friend of me, your mama, anybody just share my video so i would love you guys forever so i'm gonna show you guys all of the dry goods that i got for this um possible quarantine that we're gonna be facing um due to the coronavirus i'm actually not gonna speak on my thoughts in this video i'm going to come with um i'm going to record another video um speaking about that so I'm just going to show you guys everything I got. Um, let me know down below if you guys want me to show you everything um, that I got that is frozen. So like I said, this is just the dry goods um, and the canned foods that I got from the store. So if you haven't been to the store, y'all, you need to go um, and go early in the morning. Go at 4 o'clock in the morning when ain't nobody there. Because if you are like me, I cannot concentrate when it's a bunch of people just randomly grabbing stuff and just... Walking past, I needed it to be a peaceful, a peaceful, relaxing experience while I'm shopping. So let's get into the video. So I went to Safeway. Um, Safeway is a grocery retailer out here in California. I'm not sure if it's a nationwide supplier, but um, I went there and I got... A ton of stuff obviously you can see that um and I really only paid a dollar for all of my canned goods so I and I also got a lot of generic um not name brand um brands because a lot of those were super expensive like they were like three for five so it made it a dollar 67 which wasn't the best deal so I was going for the best deal so this is the Signature Select Whole Kernel Golden Sweet Corn. And I believe I got 22 of those, but we're going to count it really fast. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. I got 22 of those Whole Kernel Golden Sweet Corn. Now, next, I got the Cream Style Golden Sweet Corn. I loved cream corn. Like, I don't know about y'all, but I freaking love cream corn. My mom was like, who likes cream corn? I'm like, I do. What the heck? So I got um two, four, six, eight. I got eight of those. And also, I want to let you guys see that the expiration date, it's good to August the 12th, 2022. So that's um a two-year shelf life. So the next thing I got is the cut green beans. I got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, twelve of those. And again, this expires August the 6th, 2020. I got this is the French style green beans. Now I, I always wanted to eat um uh, make um a green bean casserole. I've never had a green bean casserole. My mom used to make a tuna casserole. I love tuna casserole. And if you guys have noticed, I got a tripod. I'm so excited. I'm going to show you guys in the next video. But I actually got it from Walmart for $34, y'all. So this is French style green beans. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six of those. The next thing is black eyed peas. I love black eyed peas with hot sauce. Um, the expiration date is November the 19th, 2022, and I have four of those. Now, I got sliced corn, sliced corn, sliced carrots. It expires November the 2nd, 22. One, two, three, four, five, six. I got six of those, and this is my favorite, y'all. I got these for... 65 cents at food max but everything else i got for a dollar that i showed you so, thus far um but these is van camps pork and beans if you are like me i eat my pork and beans with hot dogs it is just amazing so these expire 
these are more recent. These will expire in December the 8th, 2020. So these will expire this year. So always be mindful to um, look at the expiration date because you don't want to buy stuff that's going to expire soon. The next thing I have, my dad actually got those um, Albuquerque tuna from Costco. Um, so he got, it's, I guess it came six in a pack and they don't expire to December the 12th, 2022. So up here I got stew, nothing but stew tomatoes. So this is the Italian stout diced tomatoes. They're already, it says steamed, peeled, no salt added. I try to avoid getting salt. I'm not really a big salt fan. Um, and this expires September the 1st, 2022. I got two of those. I got the Mexican styled stewed tomatoes. Regular stewed tomatoes. Diced tomatoes. Petite diced. Now, this is no salt added sauce tomato. I don't know why it says it like that, but it should say tomato sauce. And this also doesn't expire. Oh, it doesn't have the expiration down there. Um, until September the 1st, 2022. So that's pretty cool. Um, sorry, y'all. I'm trying to get comfortable recording with the tripod so this one so i got four of the no no salted added for those all the stewed tomatoes i just got two a piece um and now the next sauce the next tomato sauce i got four of those as well as tomato paste i love tomato paste and these y'all if you ever see these please pick these up this says the SW Petite Cut Tomatoes Diced in Rich Juice. If you guys ever see this, please pick this up. You will not be disappointed. Like, I can never find these. It is amazing. But also read because they have one that says Diced in Tomato Juice and it's not the same. This one has a sweet, effervescent taste to it and I love it. Okay, so these are like $3.99, I believe, at Safeway. So I also got chicken broth, but I forgot that we had a bunch of chicken broth. So I got this for $1.25. Now, I stocked up on these black refried beans. Um, and I got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14 of those. You just really want to have enough canned goods because... um. Canned goods can stretch, and especially beans are protein, so that's always good. Now, I got two of these whole black beans because my mom really likes black beans. Then I got three of these spicy jalapeno. I love the spicy jalapeno. Whole pinto beans. My mom and dad like these. I don't. And the traditional, I got four of these. Now, I'm also going to show you guys, I got these cup of noodles, and it's 12 in a pack, and they were $4.99 from uh, Safeway as well. Now, I also got these chips. My mom absolutely loves salt and vinegar. That's like her favorite flavor. So, they were on sale two for five, as well as salt and pepper and i love the kettle chips that's like my favorite i don't like the lace chips um jalapeno this is my jam i always get jalapeno i kind of feel like salt and salt and vinegar is too salty sometimes for me too vinegary sometimes i can't eat it but i love it anyways and i got these for my dad backyard barbecue because he just likes plain chips He's not adventurous as me and my mom. And then when I make guacamole, I freaking love these Tostitos Hint of Lime Chips. They are literally the best, y'all. So if you ever see those and you never tried it, please pick them up. You will not be disappointed. They're usually two for seven. Um, So yeah, try them. 
Okay, so now we're going to come over here to where the pasta is. And the pasta was actually on sale 10 for 10, which made that a dollar. So you guys know I took advantage of that. So this is, sorry, you can see the ring light. I'm trying to like make sure the lighting is good and actually give you guys good content i hope you guys are doing well i didn't even say that i have missed you guys i love you guys so much i hope you guys really like this video i hope you guys is taking this seriously please take this seriously because this is crazy y'all this is crazy so i got medium shells and i'm gonna tell you guys one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so i got ten of those then this is small elbow macaroni and i got one two three four five six six of those this is salad macaroni because i want my mom to make macaroni salad i love it oh my god if you never had it you are missing out so i got four of those and i got this because it was 35 cents and i wanted the soy sauce one because of the little thing i don't know if he's like a pikachu or what but I just had to get it because he was on there. I don't know. I just buy stuff because it's cute. Like, that's ridiculous, but I do it all the time. So, <laughs> so the next thing I got is the ran the Rainbow Rotini. 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 So, I got four of those, and then I got two of the plain Rotini. I also got two of the Fettuccine. I actually really don't like Fettuccine that much. Like, I don't like how the noodles are so thick. I'd rather have, like, angel hair noodles or, like, these small little noodles. The next is Muscotoli. I have no clue how to pronounce it. I just grabbed it because it was up there and it was 10 for 10. I should have Googled how to say it before I got on camera and embarrassed myself, but whatever. Then I got uh, this Pasta Roni. This shells with white cheddar. Um, I got two of those. And then I also got the Parmesan cheese. Um, I think these are angel hair noodles. I got two of those. I actually want to go back and get some more of those. And y'all, if you is sleeping on couscous, I'm mad at you. If you are sleeping on couscous, I'm mad at you. Couscous is amazing. My mom freaking makes it all the time for me. It's so good. I'm so spoiled. So this is the plain kind. These were actually two for four along with the pasta roni. Uh-oh, that fell, but oh well. So I got two parmesan and one roasted garlic and olive oil. If you never even tried couscous, just at least pick one up just to try it. And when you try it and you fall in love with it, comment down below and let me know that I'll put you on, okay? So, I had to get oatmeal. I already got instant oatmeal, but I love apple cinnamon. If you know me, I love anything apple cinnamon. Apple cinnamon oatmeal, apple cinnamon rice cakes. Those is my jam. And then, these are Wellington's garlic and herb wa water crackers. I eat these with brie. This was actually, what, like $2.99 or something? Then the next thing I got is these guacamole packets. I got these five for five from Safeway. And I just put this in. And when I go to the farmer's market, I get a bunch of avocados and just smash it and put these packets in and make uh, guacamole. You can also just make guacamole fresh with uh, avocado, parsley, um, lime juice, and tomatoes. But I just put this in there because I like the packets. I don't know. But these are my favorite. I don't really prefer these. I just got them because I was there first. I got these at Food Max, but I love the spicy ones. They didn't have the spicy ones, so I just got these, and these were 89 cents. So next, I got these macaroni and cheese. I don't know why. I don't know why I got these. I just just like I want macaroni and cheese. So I got six of those, and then I also got these. Oh, hold on, y'all. Let me move the camera now. This enriched long grain rice. Um, this was four ninety nine a a bag, and my parents like um white rice. I actually got the brown rice for myself. Hold on, y'all. Let me move the camera up. 
Um, I actually got the brown rice for myself because I prefer brown rice. And I'm going to use the chicken stock to make the rice. Then my dad got this classico organic tomato and tomato herb and spices from Costco because he went the other day. So I guess it came three in a pack. Now, let me move y'all over here. So excuse my sink again, y'all. So I don't know the prices on the stuff my dad actually bought. But now I got this distilled white vinegar from Walmart and it was $2.64. I actually got these wines from the Dollar Tree. I just bought two of these. I don't know what my mom did with the other one. It says Mad, Ho Mad Housewives Sweet Pink. And obviously, I've been drinking it. So, um, I got two of those. Like I said, it was a dollar. And they don't even check your ID when you go in there and buy alcohol. They just let you buy it. Like, what if I was underage? And I don't know what this says, but on the back, <laughs> it says Rosé Wine. So, I just got it just to try it. I got these beef jerky from, um, what is it, from Walmart. Do not buy this shit. This was a waste of freaking money. This shit says soft and tender. Do you see this? This is false advertisement. This thing will rip your teeth out. I don't know why I bought them. Now, my daddy got this from Costco, these Blue Diamond Smokehouse Almonds. I don't know how much this is. I think it's like $15.99 a pack. So, the, so yesterday, I was on the phone with my daddy, and I'm like... Man, I'm finna take your Costco car and go to Costco myself and get all the stuff I want. He's like, what you gonna get? I'm like, I'm gonna get chocolate, chocolate covered almonds, salt and pepper pistachios. I was naming off hella stuff. And he like, that's all junk. And guess what? He got me chocolate covered almonds. Y'all, I was so happy. I was like, oh, did he love me? So, um, if you guys have never tried these, please go to Car Costco and buy these. They are freaking amazing. The nail shop that I go to, I um, they actually give you mimosas and these chocolate-covered almonds. And once I tried them, I was like, I have to get these from Costco. They are $15.99, kind of pricey, but I think it's worth the money. Now, my dad got these Dunkin' Donuts. I don't, I don't drink coffee, so yeah, that's not me. I also got these Milano's. If you never tried Milano's, what, what what are you doing with your life? This is strawberry chocolate. I've never tried this flavor. I can't wait to open it. It looks so good. So I'm excited, but I love Milano's. Any Milano is good. I definitely like the raspberry and chocolate one as well, or the plain one. Now, the kid and me came out in this. So I got Gushers. So my favorite kind is the tropical flavor. I got one, two, three, four, five of those. And then I got the variety pack, sorry, which is the strawberry splash and the tropical flavor. So I had to get it, I had to get it. If I'm gonna be stuck in the house, I'm gonna have to have stuff that I love to snack on. Now I got Pop-Tarts, y'all. <laughs> I'm a big old kid. I got raspberry. I usually get strawberry, but they were out of strawberry, so. Not raspberry, and I got some maraschino cherries. You, you always gotta have cherries. So now, y'all, let me show y'all. If you have never, never tried Ben and Jerry's uh, cherry Garcia ice cream, I don't even want to talk to you until you go try it. Like, if you don't try this, you're you're gonna be disappointed within yourself. Okay. Try Cherry Garcia. It's my favorite ice cream. I love it. I also got another ice cream. It's, I'm going to show y'all real fast. It's called Pistachio Almond. I never tried this kind or this brand, but they had it, so I got it because I can find Cherry Garcia. And let me show y'all one other thing because I think I'm going to do a video on all of the meat and the frozen goods that we got. This is Smackers Uncrushables, the peanut butter um, and grape jelly sandwiches, soft bread. Y'all, my daddy put me on to these, and these things is life. Oh, my God. If you got kids, you know what I'm talking about. But if you don't got kids, y'all, what are you doing? You are missing out. Like, you have to try these from Costco. I'm going to go downstairs and show you guys how my downstairs looks. So you guys can see all of the other stuff that we stocked up on. So let's go downstairs. I'm going to 
I'm gonna walk y'all through my kitchen down to my garage. So, what are you, what are you guys going to do today? Um, I'm gonna go to work after I record this video. I miss you guys, but I'm mad at y'all too. Shoot, I can mad at y'all. Ain't nobody called, ask me how I'm doing and what's going on with me. So, now this is my garage. So, y'all. Let me stand back. Okay, so basically, I. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Okay, so I got 40 of these Comet Classic Kitchen Cleaners. Um, You can get these from the Dollar Tree. Now, I swear by these, y'all. Like, if you don't do buy nothing else, I say pick this stuff up. This stuff is amazing, and I'm not just hyping this up because it is Corona crap. I'm telling y'all that I always use this, and it's amazing. Like this stuff cleans like crazy, and it's a dollar. And huh, what's the fluid ounce? You get 32 fluid ounces. That's a lot for a dollar. Now the next thing. I got is it's also Comet Classic Home Cleaner Foaming uh, Bleach Bathroom Cleaner. This was also a dollar, but see the fluid ounces is a lot less. It's 24 fluid ounces. Um, but I love this stuff. I swear by this as well. You can clean your bathroom and it will get all of the scum, soap scum, anything that's in your bathroom, it will get rid of it. Like, no lie. So... I also got these from Costco. These are just cups. They're 240 cups for $9.99, I believe. And then I got 300, 300 everyday plates. Oh my God, this is heavy. And this was $9.99. My dad also picked this up from Costco which is these Coca-Cola's 35-pack can of Coke. My mom is really the only person in the house that drinks soda. This also came from Costco. I think this was a good deal. 360 um, Crystal Clear Cuddlery for $9, $9.99. Now, this is bath tissue. It's 30 rows. Um, and then as well as the toilet paper is, I mean, the paper towels is 12 rolls and they're around $15.99 at Costco. Um, we also got three more packs of the bath tissue because, you know, they started limiting um, the amount you could get at Costco. So next we have the Crystal Glacier, the 40 pack. And this is the best pack to get for your money because it's 40 of them for $4.99. And I actually got those from Foods Co. Or not Foods Co. Foods Max or... Well, no, I got it from Food Max because I didn't get it from Walmart. Then this is the detergent I use, y'all. This is Gain. Um, It is 170 fluid ounces. Hold on. Let me try to... Oh, my foot is in the way. Okay, so... First, this is the swivel tall field flower. The sheets, um, the yeah, the sheets. You just throw them in when you're drying your clothes. The dryer sheets, and it makes your clothes smell hella good. I love this. I always get compliments on this. Like people always like, dang, what did, um, what what did you wash your clothes with? And I'll be telling them, they be writing it down and stuff. So if you ever, if you never tried this, try swivel tall. You will not be freaking disappointed. And these are like. Two ninety eight for an 80, um, 80, 80 sheet. So I got two of those from Walmart. And like I said, ugh, I'm gonna just sit this right here. Okay, so this is gain. It says you get twenty five percent more loads, and it's one hundred and seventy two fluid ounces. Um, get that one. It does one hundred and fifty loads. That is the um, it's the most expensive one. It is um. $20.44, but it's worth it because it lasts longer than the other ones. And the last thing I got 
It's um this swivel tall fabric fabric um softener. You put this in when you're washing your clothes. 120 small loads. You can get this for six six ninety eight at Walmart. So that is a bunch of stuff that we got. Now I'm gonna walk you guys over here so you guys can see. Okay, and I know y'all finna ask me about this thing. This is actually, let me move this. This is actually a tent. It says a Coleman Quill Mountain Cabin. I actually got this from Ross. I was gonna put this in my Ross video haul, but since it's laying right here, I'm just gonna put it on here. $59.99, y'all. And it rolls. See? It doesn't have wheels in the front, but it has wheels in the back. If you see that, pick that up because it's worth it. Now, excuse my house, please. Now, right over here, I have 42 bottles of, 42 gallons of water. Um, so... Let me show you first this. If you never tried this, this is a sparkling flavor waters mixed berry. Please get this. It's hella good. I love this. This is one of my favorite clients along with the peach one. But they never have peach. I can never find it. But this is Crystal Glacier one gallon water. Now, you can get this from Walmart. At Walmart, they usually sell it for 83 cents. But if you can't find it at a Walmart because it's sold out, you can find it at the Dollar Tree. And it's totally worth it. But I stocked up. So this is 42 over here. So now I'm going to walk you guys over to the other side. Uh, now, my mommy also, I had also bought these for her a long time ago. This is coconut water. I don't like it, but she just. She likes it, obviously not because she ain't been drinking it, but she used to like it. Now, look how ridiculous this is. Don't mind my ugly work boots. Those are my Uggs that I wear almost every day. But this is like, how many does it say? This is 76 waters over here. This is ridiculous, y'all. But I'd just rather be safe then sorry and be prepared so doomsday so let me tell y'all the shows that actually changed my life for the better and for the worst in some ways so doomsday preppers extreme couponing um extreme cheapskates and hoarders those are the four shows that like really turned me into who i am today like, you guys got to go watch the um, those shows if you have not seen them. Um, and then comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite one or which one have you ever heard of, which one haven't you heard of. Just let me know, like, if you even watch these shows because, I don't know, I just kind of stumbled upon these things. And then after that, I just got so obsessive to the point where I had to do with, like, these people. So... That is it for all of the dry products and all of the stuff that I got. Um, I will probably upload um, all of the frozen items that I bought um, tomorrow. So like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think of my channel. Hit the gray notification bell to be notified anytime I upload. Um, give me a thumbs up or give me a thumbs down if you didn't like the video. Um, your opinion really matters because it lets me know what you guys prefer and what you guys don't like, what you guys do like. Um, and I have so much content coming to you guys. Um, it's just been a lot going on. You won't even believe it when I tell you guys in the next video. But I love you guys. I hope you have a great day and stay safe. Wash your hands. Um, clean your faces. <laughs> clean your faces and use hand sanitizer and to everybody that was coming for me in my comments everybody that used to be like are um did you leave any for um anybody else are you starting a store look now all them hand sanitizers all that soap all that stuff then paid off me hoarding that shit now because now nobody can find hand sanitizers and 
I got hella hand sanitizers. So, yeah, I just had to gloat a little bit because y'all was just talking mess. And I was like, dang, maybe I did buy too much stuff. But now I'm putting it all in use. So I hope you guys have been stocking up or at least try to stock up some things because you want to be prepared rather than not. Um, so have a great day. I love you guys. Toodles, manudos.